The Attorney General has given details of some of the different processes that may take place whenever the Commission is evaluating recommendations for promotion. The UK Privy Council ruled in favour of JFJ, which challenged the decision of the Commission to promote the now-retired Delroy Hewitt from Superintendent to Senior Superintendent of Police. JFJ had argued that the Commission in its deliberations should have conducted a probe into allegations of human rights abuses and going forward should inform itself about officers recommended for promotion. Mrs. Malahu Fort states that the ruling comes at a time when reform was already taking place. She shares some of the pending changes. We are in the process of reforming all of the laws relating to the JCF. Um, We've been working since this administration came in, and I believe some of the work may have predated to look at a whole new law for for the the police and and looking at appointments and, and discipline. But what is clear is that if the question of promotion of a police officer comes up and there are allegations of misconduct, then you must deal with those allegations of misconduct. And under the police service, regulations, there are two different set of processes, and you must go through the process, and you must get independent report. She also reveals that under this contemplated new regime, there will be implications for the Independent Commission of Investigations Indicom. She's suggesting a possible increase in workload. So when it comes to allegations of misconduct of whatever level, then you can't just rely on what the police is saying or the police investigating itself. Um, the PSC will have to look to the Indicom for some report. And so Indicom work may expand. And in fact, it, it, if you look on its last set of quarterly reports, you would see the number of cases that it investigated, the recommendations that came at the end of the day. And I think that is where the PSC will have to look at how it treats with the recommendation of Indicom for the disciplining of police officers. Kodian Barrett, Frontline News.